Good morning guys, happy Thursday. It is a happy Thursday here. I don't know why though, it's pouring rain. We left all that stuff outside yesterday and now it's getting all wet. All our camping chairs, but at least we brought in the tent. Anyway, the girls have snuck off and they've been watching television. They don't think I know. They get in front of that screen and then they're like this and they're glued. Uh hmm, who else is in front of their screen? <laughs> Sam is home today. I see some stalking going on. There's the cat. There's the bird. I don't even think the cat knows that the bird is there. Maybe that's why the bird has been up there. Anyway, I wanted to show you guys something super cool that I found for next year. So we have a lot of new subscribers, so some of you might not know, but we homeschool the girls and um, it's super fun for us. We love homeschool. Look at this curriculum that I found. It's a Canadian curriculum, which is what I'm looking for because all the good curriculum is American. I hate that. I can't find anything good that's Canadian, but this, it's called the History of the Horse Deluxe Bundle. So imagine if you had to study all that stuff about horses, that's all of the stuff. And then they have down here, they have some of the books. So these are some of the books that you would read and all that. Yeah, isn't that amazing? Some of these books we already have. It's so awesome. I honestly believe that you should use whatever your kids are into to teach them everything. So I kind of like doing unit studies and stuff and they are so into horses and I think that would be awesome. So I'm gonna look into it, see what comes with it, see what the curriculum is like and maybe I'm gonna get them horse curriculum for September. Don't you think they would love that? Hi guys. Um, today I'm gonna be reading in the car because I'm going with my dad to do some shopping and some stuff. And this is the book that I'm gonna be reading, but the second one. So this one, this one I'm gonna be reading because I already read that one. And yeah, so let's see how this goes. All right, we're back and we got the trailer. I didn't vlog much because it's pouring rain out. I'll show you what this little handy dandy trailer looks like. It was a really cheap trailer, but you know what I do? I always fix it up and sell it. <laughs> it's almost like a hobby of mine. Buy trailers and sell it. We were going to get a tent trailer, but the guy who was supposed to, um, he was actually going to deliver it for us. He's away, so in a couple weeks, I might get that trailer still. Anyways, here's the small trailer. There it is, nice and tiny, good for the car. Sam and Sophie just got home. They went to pick up a trailer for us. Not this kind to of sleep in, but one that you can take stuff camping in with. And we walked in here and we saw the bird just walking around on the floor like he owns the place. Where is he now? Oh, there he is. Just, just cheeking out the place now. He's like, hey, I own your whole house. That's so cool. Like, honestly, who can, what is that? <laughs> Poop. Oh, no, to stop pooping. <laughs> Pooping everywhere. Who can say they have a crow as a friend? Ah, ah. He's looking for. Do you hear him talking? Can you wait? Okay. So, middle day, I'm going to be making slime. It's not slime, it's like a putty ish slime. Cornstarch and water. Like, it's kind of like that, but it doesn't melt or anything. My bangs look terrible today. So. Let's go I'll start. So if you guys want to make this at home, it's really easy and simple. Of course you need cornstarch. Cornstarch. And you need dish soap. Dawn dish soap. I have blue because I, I want mine to be blue. Um, you need a spoon and a bowl. I'm just gonna scoop some out on my bowl. How much you want it to be like once you have your um cornstarch in a bowl should look like this then you're gonna take your dom dish soap so basically you just want to put a little bit in there okay so now you'll go in and add more whenever you want like of your dish soap so now you mix Mix, mix, mix. I need more clothes. Totes more. And after you can use the soap. 
soap. I feel like that still. So, if you add a little too much soap, then you could always add just a little bit more cornstarch. Keep on mixing. It should be all clumpy then clump together. And if it doesn't dye, um, it, then we can add some food coloring in. You know, because we have that. We totally have that and we don't need to go to the store. So, I think mine's good enough to start working it on the table. On the table. That's what it's supposed to look like? It kinda is like I'm stretching the water. I love doing slime, but this is more like a brick. Mine is. No, it doesn't turn into water when you just let it sit, so that's good. It's like a slime that melts in your hand, but it's not water. I really like this slime. Don't look at me like this. Um, I really want to make more of these ki kinds of slimes because they're good for like fidget toys. And I'm going to be making another one. Me too. We'll see, just a tiny little batch, like a little bit tinier than these. But try it out. It's seriously good. Hi guys, we're at the library. And uh, Gabby wanted to check all the cushions. And you know what we found? One of these. These credit cards. We have to check to see if there's any money on it. So we're going to check it out. See if there's any money on it. And Gabby signed up for a reading program. So did Sophie. And yeah. They're looking for books. You signing out some books? Yeah. Awesome. Let's go sign them out. So we're just leaving the library. I think Sam vlogged in there. I didn't. Anyway, Sophie's got her baby. Let's show them. Let's see. Wait, stop, Sophie. Sophie's got her baby all set in there. And her diaper bag, right? Of course, you know like when the kids do that thing where they they walk off and they leave you with all their toys? Well, I was pushing her stroller and her doll and this girl, this lady passed me. She held the door open for me and looked at my baby and then she kind of did a funny face and then she looked at me and was like, really, you're pushing a baby that's not alive? I had to tell her, wait, this, this is not my baby. And then she started laughing because yeah, it was super embarrassing. Hi hey guys, it's about supper time and I'm off to get some pizza. We haven't had this for a while and now we're gonna have some. Stuffed crust, nine bucks. Stuffed crust pizza. All right you guys, it is Thursday night and we are headed to camping. The weather is gorgeous, can you guys see? Weather is gorgeous. We stopped along the way and we got a chocolate chill, not on my diet, but I'm having Thursday night break. I'm having a Thursday break day. Yeah. Gotta have one every once in a while, every couple of weeks. Yeah. Girls got a chocolate chill. Do you guys have a chocolate no, chill? No, I got a coffee chill. Sophie did not get a coffee chill. But you got three little puppies back there. Aren't they the cutest little things? So, I was, well, he was starting to get my chocolate chill. Oh, well, no chocolate chills for puppies. And Dad got a huge, gigantic Rolled the rim. coffee. Roll the rim. Is it early? Late for that? Rub the rim, Canada 150. Wow, so he could win a free coffee because it's Canada's birthday this weekend. That's why we're going camping. It's a long weekend for us. So let's go, let's get started. Let's go camping. Okay, you guys, we're at camping. Girls are already climbing in the tent, getting ready for bed. We got this super cool, <laughs> we got this super cool air mattress. Yesterday when we were out shopping, oh. I was looking for um, the oh, yeah. double ones and I ended up finding a queen oh, one. It was yeah, right behind yeah. me when I was looking on the shelf. Anyway, <coughs> it barely fits in this tent. So what happened was that where we camp called us today and said, hey, all the campgrounds are flooded because it's been pouring rain for days and we're canceling, canceling all camping for everybody. And we were like, what? This is terrible. So then the girls and I decided we'll just camp at home, huh? You decided. Yeah, I decided. But you guys agreed. Are you excited? Yeah, I agree. I'm not sleeping in here. No, yeah, so yeah. basically yeah. I got our small little two-man tent. Is it a two-man or a four-man? Yeah. I got our small little tent out and I set it up in the back room, in the playroom. 
and I thought we could lay in there and watch movies and then go to sleep. And it turns out it only fits them. Doesn't fit me. We're gonna camp down here. I think we're gonna lose the tent. You guys wanna lose the tent? Yeah, because like, where am I gonna fit? Watch what happens. Actually, I could fit in here. I could not fit Yeah, like, in. we could not move. Sophie's taking all the spot <laughs> off with her legs. That's how I usually sleep. Like this what? is how she usually sleeps. Don't put your feet on the camera. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, wait, watch out. I'm <laughs> Sophia. Oh, am I on your hair? Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> I need to fix my face. Gabby's got a wedgie and she can't even fix it because no. there's no room. Okay, there we go. Oh. <laughs> you both can't even put mommy in the yeah. my bag. So I think what's going to have to happen is we're going to have to lose the tent. No. Let's lose the tent. Yeah. Are you ready to lose the tent? Let's lose the tent with magic. Magic. Avocado. <laughs> there we are. <laughs> All Do fixed it again. Up. Do it again. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna show you our setup for the night. We are camping out. We are I'll camping. I'll go in my bed. We're camp. Yeah, you go in your bed, and I'll show you how cute. Um, yeah, we're all sleeping down here tonight. Except for Dad. Dad will sleep upstairs and hold down the fort up there. And all us girls, we're gonna sleep in the playroom. All right. So this is how cute the bed is. Didn't it turn out so cute? We had one of these a long time ago too. So there's Sophie's spot. There's Mama's spot. Wait, wait. Where's Gabby? Where is she? Oh, <laughs> there's Gabby's spot. There's only one trouble with Gabby's spot. We already had an incident. We left the window open so it'll be nice and cool in here. I'll open that one up there too. And what happens when Gabby stands up? Do a mock stand up. Do a mock stand up. Right above her head is the window thing. She already jammed her back on it. Let's see. Imagine you're sound asleep and you're getting, what is wrong with you? <laughs> what is wrong? <laughs> Okay, stand up, dead girl. Here, help me. Okay, watch. What? Right above your head. I don't know. We'll have to be careful about that. Let's see. She already smashed her back on it. Oh. Can't see anything with all this hair. Why? Oh, look. There's three spots there. See, look. Three Ooh, spots. Where? Right here. Anyway, that's what we're doing. We're going to sleep there. We're going to pick a movie on the TV. Before we end today's uh, vlog, we're going to do comment of the day and I think, or question of the day. And I think we have two. First of all, um, Anya Equestrian asks, says, oh, wait, I have a dog in my face. <laughs> oh, there's dogs all I'm away. getting hurt today. <laughs> first here, then here. Um, okay, uh -huh. get out of my face. My Okay, shh, listen. And I'm uh oh, I lost it now. Okay, so Here you Anya Equestrian says, "Hi, I have a question. What do you film with? We film with, with the, the Canon G7X. G7X. Yeah, Jinx. Yeah, uh, we used to use the Sony, but we upgraded to Canon because it's better in dark light conditions. <laughs> and also from NL Equestrian." She wants to, she says, Ziggy is so cute. Is he a lessons horse? As in, will the girls be able to ride him? And the answer yes. is yes. They are just. I don't want to. They're just integrating him into the lessons right now, aren't they? Probably not right now. So they're just trying him out a little bit to make sure that he is a good fit. And he seems like he's a good fit. They say at the barn that he's not very bright and that he it takes him a lot to learn things but i don't know seems really good to me does he seem good to yeah, you yeah he's dumb though yeah and gabby doesn't like him not like um dumb by a stupid horse like that yeah, i don't dumb. like yeah there are no he's dumb like, horses not smart. He's guys dumb. even he though he's like on him. yeah i have all the dogs on me <laughs> <laughs> Toby. I just sometimes have to move his head like two. Anyway, so uh, that is it for today. I hope we answered at least two, two of your questions. So we yeah. will see you tomorrow. We have lots of fun things planned for this weekend starting on Saturday on starting on Saturday because it is Canada Day weekend. Canada is 150 years old. I'm super excited <laughs> to celebrate. Right? No, let me do this. But we will be sleeping in tomorrow, right girls? No. Yeah. All right. See you later, guys. Bye. Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.